everybody. Welcome. Oh my God. <laughs> it's Rachel Owens Van Cobb and you are watching Modern Modesty with RVC. Welcome everyone to the first episode of Modern Modesty with RVC. I am excited. I am everything with an E of bringing faith and fashion together. It's just time for it. So you are about to enjoy a journey with me through fashion into transformation of not just your closet, but maybe your confidence or anything that is lacking in between. Okay, so first let's back up we need to get to know each other, right? So I wanna first introduce myself to you. For those that don't know, I'm Rachel Owens Van Cobb. And let me start with the things I love. I love Jesus. That is first and foremost, honey, all things Jesus. I love my parents that are also my pastors. They do an amazing job doing both in my life. Wouldn't be here without them. <laughs> I love my husband, my hubby my darling, my baby. He's the man behind the camera, but definitely the man by my side. And I love my church family, Emmanuel's Temple. Oh my God, you gotta check us out. I love fashion. I like to feel it for everyone else and make other people feel beautiful. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Five, count them, five reasons why you should watch, like, and subscribe to Modern Modesty with RBC. Reason number one. Faith and fashion can go together. They are not mortal enemies, honey. They can become best friends, literally, BFF. The best faith and best fashion. Uh-oh, because we are living epistles read by all men. So what better way to be a billboard for Christ than letting what's on the inside come out on the outside? Reason number two, modern modesty is real and it's relevant. We have so many different influences. What you should wear, what you shouldn't wear. Modesty should show us that we don't have to hide behind burlap and sackcloth and ashes. Proverbs 31 says that she's clothed in strength and dignity or even strength and honor in what she has on. Reason number three, closet confessions. Like, what is your closet saying? Is it saying we're excited about life? We're excited about new things happening in our life? Or is it saying we've given up? We're tired, does the last leg, does it talk about all of your hurts and pains? Or is it talking about new experiences? I also believe that your closet not only confesses things, but also shows your convictions, what you believe in, what you believe about yourself. Reason number four. It's just gonna be flat out exciting. It's going to be inspiring and downright hilarious. I mean, we all need to laugh. I'm talking about ladies and gentlemen. Every age, doesn't matter your race, none of that. Even if you're not professing to be a Christian, I promise you, I promise, I promise. Modesty is okay, like I can look good. And you know what, that transformation that may just start with your closet, also might take root on the inside. Which brings me to reason number five, transformation of you, being that best version of you that you can. Now it's time for us to step out and step into what God has for us. So what can you expect next? So I'm actually taking a trip to New York with my husband. And I'm gonna show you some amazing trends that you can make happen for you in a modest way. Fall trends as well, you don't wanna miss it. I'll have a live sale during this time. This is probably the last time you're just gonna see me sitting in a chair talking like this. I'm gonna be up about going through different racks. I'm gonna be bringing on live models. That's right, not just like pictures like boop, 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 dress like this, look like this and you're not even that size. And if nothing else, if you just enjoy the silly goofiness of myself or the others I'm gonna have on, honey, you can just laugh all your time. As long as I made somebody smile, as long as I brought someone a little closer to the joy of the Lord, you know what, I did my job. But hopefully I can do it with you looking good. So please, 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 like, subscribe, and share it with other people. All right, everybody, be blessed. And remember, keep faith and please, Keep the fashion.